My name is LJ Roberts and I made the piece The Queer Houses of Brooklyn and the Three Towns of Brooklyn, Bushwick, and Midwalk in the, during the 41st year of the Stonewall era. We're sitting in Glitter House right now, which is a queer collective house in Brooklyn. And I am an artist that makes knitted and quilted and embroidered installations. I moved to New York in 2009 and found this really incredible, creative, artistic, performance, filmmaking community of queer people living in Brooklyn. And so the map is, um, it's quite large and you can approach it. Um, it's um, knitted mostly on children's toy knitting machines, including a Barbie knitting machine from 1974, which is kind of the crux of um, the machinery I use, and also a cool quarter, which is a pink sparkly machine. So for this piece, I did the illustrations on the buttons of all the queer houses, and I basically asked people in the queer houses, you know, what were the images they wanted to see on in, on the icon of their house. Or yeah, I either did that or I kind of just literally drew what their house name was. So I made the map that LJ based this piece off of for the program for the first Queer House Field Day, which is a community building event that the Quorum Collective has done for the past few years as a way of bringing together folks living in the set of queer collective houses that have been formed in Brooklyn over the last number of years. So I made the map to make visible the geography of the queer collective houses of Brooklyn right now and to connect this moment to the hist to both queer history and to the underlying history of Brooklyn. I'm really excited to be part of like this Brooklyn scene right now that feels like we're all working together to kind of continue on this queer tradition of making art in New York.